up? It's your boy Slim Thugger Triple D. Guess what? We about to go live on the Vita Local Morning Show, man. Tune in. It's going down. Here today. Yeah. Put your hands together for the boss hog himself. What up, baby? We back. It's What's time. good? Wow. Live on the morning show with my girl Vita. What up? Yo, can I just quickly, Slim Thug, I will never forget. I tell this story <laughs> every time I see you because it's just so funny to me. This And I show, it dates us a little bit because this is when Twitter first came out. When Twitter first hit the scene, we was at the BET Awards. And this is when, after the BET Awards, they would throw the free party. And remember, everything was free. Playing Skills was there. Uh, a lot of people from the Triple D was there. And... I was so drunk mm. that I was knocked out in the middle of the party on a chair at a BT at a BT party? after party, and I was I was slobber drunk, like like head to the side, it, it, yeah. And so Slim comes up to me and tweets <laughs> that this drunk chick is at the BT awards, and it just so happened to be, I'm the drunk chick. Oh, he even know. Oh, he know her. I don't know. I was know. the drunk chick. Uh, Speaking of proud moments, congratulations on your new body of work about to hit the scene. Yeah, Sugar Daddy Slim, February 14th for the ladies, you know what I'm saying? Y'all make sure y'all cop that. Sugar Daddy. Sugar Daddy, Daddy Slim. Slim on the prowl is what I like to comment. Because I, I, I have never known you to be a Sugar Daddy right. Slim. You, you're a bit frugal with your right. money when it comes to tricking with these chicks. I don't take them out to eat is what I used to say. But, hey. you know, you get about 38 and then, you know, you still want them 25-year-old Instagram chicks. You got to, you know what I'm saying, pay for that dinner sometime. And that dinner ain't too bad. 200 ain't a bad deal on dinner. You know what I'm saying to me, so. Oh, so you know, Because all my whole life, I've been, I don't take them out there. I've been saving for this. Right. You know, That's so. what I'm saying. <laughs> I'm really, You've been saving I, to be a sugar daddy, Slim? <laughs> really? Now that I'm in my 40s, I can afford to give me a when young. When I saw what it was called. Not young, R. Kelly young. 25 hey, and up. Uh, okay. okay. Let's clarify no, that. Let's clarify I, that. Clearly. Disclaimer. <laughs> clearly, when I saw sugar daddy Slim, I said, this has got to be a typo. This has got to be. <laughs> Like he said, he's at that point in his yeah. life now where he's ready to own that. Right. Yeah. So, okay. I mean, I know you, like, you know, want to do, like, the whole date thing, but is, yeah. are college tuitions a part of the sugar daddy? Oh, slim God. Thing? Oh, she college is kind of, that's how young. Man, it's real out here, the struggle real. That's like 70 grand. That's that's she's 70 racks behind right now. I mean, yeah. I ain't looking for 70. I, I can take one. Well, let's talk what about it after this, then. You okay, know, Sugar Slim, I like giving back. <laughs> All kind of way. Slim Thug, does, Slim Thug does give back a lot. And I want you to talk about your project you got going in your community, because you buying, buying okay. up the block. I you mean, changing lives in Houston, one house at a time. Right. I mean, well, what happened was, you know, I did the Boss Life thing, a mix, I mean, a mixtape album. It turned into a clothing line. Y'all get that Boss Life clothing. We got a lot of fresh gear, you know, with all the... Gucci and all of oh, that. Oh, that's the B is on the shirt. Yeah. Yeah. Start, start buying. It's time that we start buying. It's time we support each people. other. Sure. Boss Life World, man. Check it out. Check out my Instagram, Slim Thug. Man, we got quality products. We do this. We make sure it's fresh. You know what I'm saying? I do have so dope stuff. We try to do it. Yeah, we ain't in there trying to do nothing goofy and just get no money. You know, this stuff we actually wear every day. We like it. Good quality stuff. Yeah. yeah. Uh, it's so good you can wear it two days in a row. Two days in a row. Slim had the same outfit on yesterday. <laughs> Why are you no, no, that's <laughs> real life. Like so did you. So yeah. did I. That's real life. So did I. If we're doing that, right. Kay, I'd have got the same jeans. Shut up, girls! <laughs> <laughs> doing that. It's so dope you can wear it twice. That's what we, it got to be 24 hours on the outfit, is my rule. But anyway, uh, <laughs> but uh, you know, that, that boss life clothing, it got big. You know, we started getting a lot of community support. Uh, they gave me a day in Houston, you know, for all the stuff we was doing. That turned into, man, what else can we do for the community? Right. Okay, so we ended up going to my old neighborhood, buying up hot lots and building homes on them. So we built a brand new uh, community, try to stop gentrification in my hood, like mm -hmm. build low-income homes. We built about 10 houses. And then last year, we actually gave away a whole paid-out house to a hurricane victim. Yeah. yeah, we right. got a house and gave her a brand-new house. I mean, not brand-new. We re Boss Life Construction did it real right. nice and gave it to a paid-out. So, you know, we've been, just, we've been getting involved in the community. 
And um, this year I had teamed up with a uh, shoe shoe palace, right? And they had a lot of shoes. They was, we were supposed to get like a th- uh, three thousand. So my initial plan was let me give a thousand away in Houston, a thousand away in Dallas, a thousand away in San Antonio, just to the um, you know different markets that I always supported me. I just want to sh- you know spread the love. Exactly. And that's stuff. what you did yesterday. We was at the MLK Center and uh, Slim had over three hundred over three hundred pair of shoes that you gave away. We gonna make them give more next year. We gonna stay on. Right, right. I, I thought no, that, that was, was really super dope. dope. That was really yeah. dope. I was gonna say, speaking of boss life, I know you had, you just had the uh, boss life ball. Right. How was it? It looked dope. We right. need to get invited next year. Y'all definitely, man. Y'all Dallas need to definitely get involved with the boss life ball. We That's do big. it every MLK weekend. When I say it's suit and tie, we spend a lot of money. Make sure we get the nicest venue that black people don't hardly ever be in, you know. Yeah, and man. we come in there, we show out, man. And it's a lot of business owners from the cake lady to the owner of the rock is in there, you know. So it's a lot of networking going on. It's a beautiful oh, thing. Dope. But and then at the same time, it's it's a foundation. So you come in, you getting clean, and you giving back at the same time. Yeah. I like that. When yeah. did you decide that, yeah. okay, I'm not going to focus on this rap money, and I'm going to switch it over to this construction company money, this foundation money, yeah. this buying the block money and i I wouldn't say i switched because honestly like i don't even i never even touched the uh House a uh, hammer or nail. Like, I, ain't even, I mean, that's just, nah, I touched, I'm down with that, but I'm just oh, saying, okay. like, that's kind of like a retirement yeah. thing for me. I just okay. kind of invest in that. And we let that keep building. But uh, rap is paying for everything I do still. I still put out music all the time. I'm just horrible at promotion. You know what I'm saying? I'm horrible. I post it on Instagram and that's it. And you know, it, right. I don't, you don't come do out here. Stuff, yeah, I don't yeah. do a lot of that like we used to. Like, right. See, and that's what gee. people don't get, like, because I'm really kind of just getting at my fan base. My yeah. guy, Ray. Core, fan, but my core, core fan base. No, they, I there. dropped, you know, probably three, eight, three times a year. But last year I didn't do nothing because it was my 20 year anniversary. So I just took off. But uh, of what? Off, uh, off, off, off music, in the game right. since oh, 1998. Right. I've been in the game 20 years. Mm. So, uh, so you know, I just now I'm gonna drop about three, four projects. Me and Boston George just dropped Big Bad Boston and the Boss. On um, if you don't know him, he just signed with Jeezy, yeah. the Houston mm-hmm. rapper. Mm-hmm. He he doing this thing. Look out for him. I got some stuff with my uh, boy Yellow Filler right here. He's an up and coming artist out of Houston. Yellow in the building. Yellow, yellow in the building. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So we just stand active, man, trying to keep them country rap tunes going. You know, like I say, I don't really be doing it for the radio. But you also don't need to. You know, I, I feel like I'm an OG. I say let the oh, yeah. youngsters have the, you know, the, you. The, and let me just direct get to my people and, you know, keep country rap tunes going. But I love to see y'all growth. I love to see how, you know, y'all got boys popping off out here. You know, Dallas is doing their thing. So. Beasy. Yeah, yeah. Beasy, man. That's a beautiful thing, you know, because I've been around all this time. Like, man, Dallas deserve it. Hey, Slim, look at me. <laughs> started off in the morning day. show. You know what I'm saying? She started right. off as the drunk right. girl at the BT right. Awards. Exactly. <laughs> morning show. She was right. And now she, they got who you What you not going to do is bring that back to us. That that's, 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 that's a good thing to say right now because I've been thinking like, this man really people need to realize like stop trying to hit quick licks stop trying to mess over people who you don't think is somebody like mm-hmm. you never know like you say the drug lady at the BET Awards not a morning show you know, <laughs> you know, you know exactly. what I'm saying yes, these people who you try to mess over with you gonna see them you know if you live in Dallas yeah. you gonna see these people the rest of your life so yeah. <laughs> let me let me that, that just leads me to this you know I, I don't want to get too personal but okay Slim you're in Dallas and I always thought Toya was going to be the one. <laughs> I did. Oh, I always thought Toya was going to yeah. be the one. Y'all had that back and forth history yeah. that real that that real right. lovers have, you know. It was real. It, it was, was real, real. real. And I read this quote. And they say if love is really real, when you when you break up, you yeah. cannot be friends. If it was a real 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 yeah. love. Because yeah. When you're still friends and you br- break up, you that. always go right. back. You always That's go how back. That's with us. And then, you know, it just got to a point where, you know, she moved to L.A. And, you know, I ain't with separating, you know, from Houston. Long so we kind of just distanced ourselves. But at the same time, I'm so happy to see that she has what she's been looking for. She want she been wanting a husband, husband and a baby. Like, so I'm just so happy because she's a good person. Like, mm-hmm. and, you know, at the end of the day, I don't feel like later on, I think we kind of separated. But in that time, it was real good. But like I say, I'm proud of her and, and her family, you know, and she's still family yeah, to me. So was she asking yeah. you for a baby and you were saying no? Uh, nah, <laughs> I, I, we wasn't even together around that time, but she did it. She, she didn't express it to me like, let's have a baby, but she mm-hmm. expressed that she did want a baby and wanted to get married. 
before she did that. Yeah, and yeah. she wasn't ready. No, I'm fixed, actually. What? Yes, you I got, got three hey. kids. I, I got three boys. Some, yeah, I already got three right. boys. I right. got fixed. Yeah. All right, me too. You know you can get on fix. <laughs> yeah, I can get on fix if I get married, but that's the only way I'm going to do it. You can get on fix? I'm sorry, Chaotic, yeah. you, all, you got all girls. Me and Slim got all 7, boys. 7,000. Oh, I thought yeah. you were saying you was fixed. You're not fixed. Well, <laughs> you know what? Some lucky lady might get this man unfixed tonight at the House of Blue. Hey. I'm, hey. Looking for, I'm looking for somebody. If you that bad to make me get unfixed, baby, pull up. <laughs> she that bad. Pull up. I'm just trying to get I'm bad ready, enough bro. to I ain't get running from the sweet loans off. Yeah, Slim Thug, you got your listening party going on tonight for Sugar Daddy Slim at the House of Blues. I mean, we are so, I'm excited. I'm definitely excited to hear you know, it. It's going to be the old country rap tone, you know, the stuff. But I had came up with why is it always a bunch of thugs and dudes at my shows and I said man you making all this sound so I had to do a project for the ladies you know yes. I need to do something you know to make them ladies get pull up to them shows so I can we see. appreciate yes. you yeah. they going crazy on Instagram I'm pretty sure all of them are already <laughs> like so where the show at tonight House of Blues let's pull up at six, right? I think I want to pull up we gonna pull up no, ladies please, sugar daddy slim baby if you're in Dallas you want to get you know I'll take you back to Houston I'm ready to uh, get your flu right now that <laughs> 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 Yeah. Slim, you I'm married. <laughs> That's right, Kay. House of Blues, and make sure the project drops um, February 14th, Sugar Daddy Slim. Valentine's Day. So, this really yeah. is for the, the, uh, for for the ladies. 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 New single marketing. Players Get Chose out right now, man. Check that out. Players Get Chose. Okay, Sugar Daddy Slim. All right, we'll see you tonight at the House of Blues. Thank you. I appreciate you. All right.